Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, it's Arad and uh, in today's video we're gonna check into 11th of July 2022 and uh, if you do uh, find yourself guys interested in a personal reading with me you can always uh, go to my website uh, which link you are gonna find in the description down below and uh, there at the very front page you will see a full list of my uh, services and as well their pricing so with that said let's uh, do the cut and uh, see what we got for the day uh, the first card of the day that is going to be the Queen of Pentacles uh, the second card of the day that is going to be the uh, Chariot card and the third one of the day uh, we do have the page of cups so this is how the elemental dignity of the day uh, stands the day is going to relate us with uh, a person or a society of people uh, that is the queen of pentacles into the middle of uh, of the reading and uh, whether it is a person or a society of uh, of people there will be a, a a change into the and i don't know how to put it into english the change into our positions within the society or in regards to that person uh and that change is going to be for the better what i mean is that it's going to be improving position rather than a deteriorating position so if we were just for example uh, with our person a just we, we just knew each other at that particular day the position will evolve more toward friendship or if we are friends maybe is going to evolve into a something bigger than just a friendship uh, now because we do have the queen of pentacles and the page of cups sitting next to each other this is a very very strong elemental dignity it is a passive friends and pretty much does describe unfound potential of a emotional attachment in other words <clears throat> that it is within the person okay and within us as well uh, which basically speak that whether it is a society or whether it is a person that we are going to revolve around today uh, it's just we can we can grow to love the society or to love that individual now this doesn't have to be you know that uh, intimate love out there because the page of cups the emotional attachment could be any kind of love but we we could today for example find a friend that we're gonna love very very much and they are gonna love us a uh, as well and uh with the interaction of that society and the interaction of that or of that person i will stop saying society i will grow to i will just move to say person but bear in mind that that could be as well society every time when i say a person so <clears throat> the interaction with uh, with that person today uh, can help us as well uh, readjust or realign with the change which is a looming on the horizon whether within our career or whether uh, within our personal and uh, relationship life, life either through example we are going to see within them or either it is because they are going to help us kind of like readjust better with uh, with the uh, with the environment but one is certain from these cards guys if we had the past few days or maybe several several days being colors that's not going to be the case at the 11th of uh, july 2020 uh 2022 now this person they see yeah well they they do see a potential within within us a heretofore so to speak unexplored and it, it, it's kind of like a it's i can't say that it is a desire but it is a drive it's a it's it's a it's a focal point for them to pretty much 
point us a direction where we can develop that particular uh, that particular potential. And from the other elements of dignity, we can see that that individual is a very, very proud of us. And also we being into their into their life, either into the life of of that society or into the life of that person somewhat kind of like causes them to consider a uh, wish fulfillment and as well they feel much much stronger when we are uh, when we are around uh, it's uh, it's kind of like they, they do feel that surge of I can't say well it is an energy but also not exactly it's a surge of just confidence and it's a surge of a uh, uh it's a surge of momentum so to speak and ba and basically they do feel way more capable when we are around if we aren't around so bottom line to that it is that throughout the day we are going to see that we are very very significant to someone or <laughs> a to something and uh, maybe that could be an individual that we can make business with or a society that we can make business with for business i i don't like the cards for business and i'll tell you why uh, it is because all these cards they do imply a static movement so there there isn't much or room of a variety while yeah there is a change looming on the horizon it, it is a four sort change meaning that we uh, and, and them we are seeing or maybe not the entire thing but we are seeing where and, and how it's going to take place and pretty much there isn't much room to move out of it and with business you know Trevek has yeah uh, i'm sorry that's a bulgarian world a person has to be a uh, agile it has to be adaptable however for a for a love life it's uh or for a love development that is a very good uh very good elemental dignities and pretty much uh, how it stands it is that little by a little within within this interaction there is going to be a emotions settling in emotions which are going to be constrained only in between us and them and nothing can really touch them outside however one warning i would like to give here and that comes from the elemental dignity of the queen of pentacles and the uh the chariot card it is that because these emotions are going to seem and feel so pure uh, it doesn't have to be today, maybe a few days down the road. Uh, the, a decision, a unanimous decision may be uh, taken that, you know, uh, that you both should throw yourself into some kind of a, not some kind of a, but intimate a relationship. That may happen to be quite of a premature choice. Uh, here the danger is throwing yourself before into into the enterprise before you actually know what you are signing yourself up to remember there is always or at least at that stage there are a lot of potentials unexplored and you do want to explore them before you do decide do you want to actually participate into those potentials or uh, or not and finally uh, that individual uh, it feels genuinely bad when they are emotionally when they're emotionally unattached so when you aren't around or you deny them being around it's more accurate to be said that doesn't they, they don't handle that very well and so with that said guys uh this is the daily uh tarot guidance for july 11th 2022 hopefully you do enjoy it and you do like it and uh we are to see each other next time until then bye